right guys, Destiny Weekly. I just got the first Destiny Weekly up today and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, please leave a like on that video and this video and subscribe to the channel for more Destiny Weekly every week. And I'm running, and I'm talking way too fast. So yeah guys, I hope you guys enjoyed Destiny Weekly. I hope you guys enjoyed it last week. If you didn't watch it last week, there will be a link in the description below for a playlist where you can watch Destiny Weekly. So this week is Victory Week Faction Rally. Victory Week you saw last last week you saw me do Faction Rally. This week's Victory Week, so I have not logged in because I don't want to see who won until you guys see. Because I want to be have my reaction with you guys. So let's rock. Yes, I did create a warlock um, level. I did create a warlock. Um, I'm running through my Warlock now, I just created one, I'm going to run through it, and I'm going to get the care of my Warlock all up and running. When I do a coverage of the story, it'll be on the Titan, just so you guys know, so, yeah. Let's, we just hop into a party so no one can hear me over uh, Fire Team chat, and... We got everything back, including I cause, including celebrate the win of Dead Orbit. Ah, oh, sad. Um, so Dead Orbit has won, meaning we can go pick up the weapon now. So let's go pop over to Dead Orbit. Also, I forgot to show in the last video, sweet business. We got it, and I said I'd show it, and I never did. So yeah, I've got sweet business, and I've got all my faction gear still sitting here, um, from when we unboxed all those faction things. I also did get in between recordings, I'm not sure if I got this on recording, but I got a grenade launcher, which is kind of neat, so. Yeah, I've got a, I've got a nice grenade launcher, um, and I'm, I've kind of made it a non-blast radius grenade launcher now, let me just power it up to there. That should be a pretty good blast radius grenade launcher. And uh, now, let's pop down. Since I'm at 280 light, I can finally buy mods. And I am talking way too much. But since I'm at 280, I can finally buy mods. And let's see what we got for today. So, we've got the Flashpoint this week is on the EDZ. Okay, sweet. The Nightfall. No clue what that is. Let's check out what the Nightfall is. Your Nightfall for this week is the sing song time warp is anomalies so we got anomalies this week okay so hopefully wizard cat who wanted to do the nightfall so badly last week can get it done this week also eververse we got something for me Welcome to Eververse. Never did anything, so let's see what she is. Oh, it's just new stuff. So this week we've got a... Oh, sweet. So we've got a... We've got a, um... Looks like a, something from the Dubious Folly. We've got a ornament from the Dubious Folly. And this is an ornament from Mida. The snowman from Mida. There you go. The shaders for this week are Bumblebee. That one and that one. Fire Team Medallion. Excellent choice. Got, we got, we got sick, and we've got taunt dance for the sparrow this week. We have pasta loot, so this is it right here. And then for the two ships this week, we have no exotics, so we have star bolt, and this is it. Thank you now, for shopping at Eververse. Don't yeah. know where my uncle now, finds it. We got to go back and turn in stuff. So we got a new rocket launcher. It's not that good, but it's actually um, a legendary rocket launcher. But it'd be filling me up a lot. So I think what I'm gonna do is I just use, uh, I just use uh, warp of coil whenever I need to. Um, 
Yeah, well, let's go see what Dead Orbit's got. Let's see what Dead Orbit's got. Um, because, of course, they won, so everyone's going to run over there now. I want to know how much they want to because I bet your future will call with the time high. Have you accepted the truth of Dead Orbit? Better late than never. You've come at a good time. Dead Orbit can be magnanimous in victory. See for yourself what we have to offer. The Dead Orbit, they're selling their scout rifle. With these horrible perks, to be honest. It's a horrible scout rifle. I'm not even sure if I'm going to buy it. It's not a really good one, and I don't think I'm going to actually buy Dead Orbit's rifle. Because I'm not even pledged to Dead Orbit. I'm in. So glad you have come. I guess I pretty much have to buy it. I wanted um, one of these, but it's so much money, and it's so much glimmer, and I'm not gonna make that glimmer up. Yeah, Until so we see. meet again. Like, guys, give me a minute here, and I'm gonna think if I should buy it. Alright, guys. So I guess I have to just to show off their winning, um, their winning gun for the video, and I'll get the well back. Welcome back. But um, I'm not gonna buy anything else for a while, so let's just grab the weapon here. It's called Haunted Earth. So we'll run that a few times, but yeah, I was really hoping to see what call would win it. Shame. Alright. So now that we've picked up the Dead Orbit Scout Rifle, let's um let's let's do some oh wait, I forgot about I forgot about something. So this is what I always do every faction every weekly reset as I run down here after I remember that we have a weekly reset and it's not faction rally. I have to run down here and walk over to Cade. There he is. Oh, hello. Walk over to Cade. Look, um, no refunds, okay? Acquire all of his treasure maps because Back to the wild. that's what you want to do when you get a weekly reset. Go acquire all of Cade's treasure maps and then go run over to Ikora. First stuff. I'm gonna run over to Icora, guys. Actually, guys, look. So, they did what they said they'd do. They replaced all the, like, future World Cup flags and everything with gigantic Dead Orbit flags. Look right there, there's a gigantic Dead Orbit flag right there. So, yeah, they replaced every, like, faction flag they had with a Dead Orbit flag, which I think looks amazing. Because they actually did that, that is a great, that is a great idea. Show the Legion who is boss during this. Get to see you. Yes, Guardian. May it serve you well, Guardian. He stirs in the vault. Why? Oh, I see. What can you teach me? I see now. So you can replay a mission that Icora gives you, and this mission um, will give me fire rep. This mission will give me stuff, so we'll just, I'll do that later. I think it still appears right no. here as like a mission, a red war mission. It does, okay. So, guys, what we're gonna do is we're gonna head to the E, D. They're supposed to be so wise and all knowing. Kidding. It is a bunch of flashpoints, and I'll complete all those later. Um, so, we're gonna head to the E, E, D, Z, and another. There are no public events whatsoever. This is the EDZ is supposed to be the biggest place in the game. Okay, there's one. There's one right up here. So let's go land there. Yep. All clear. Let's go get this first public event. This is worth your time.
in the field. We have sightings of Red Legion infiltrators on their way. Chase them out. They think they'll spy on my territory. Ugh. rig out of here. Do I see the cabal fleeing with tails tucked? Well done. Okay. I think it's on top of this building. <laughs> I think that's actually a mnemonic weapon. It sounded like a mnemonic weapon. Let's check it. Scout rifle. It's 
think it might be mnemonic -y. Let's check. We should be able to see if it's mnemonic -y right here. If we just, yup. I think this is a mnemonic -y right there. Yeah, you can even tell. This is a mnemonic -y scout rifle. Um, so yeah, you'll get this from the mnemonic -y. Um, So, yeah. Let's see what it looks like in like future work hall. Ooh, that actually looked good. That actually looked like a cool weapon. But yeah, this is the mnemonic -y scout rifle, so... I'm not gonna keep it, because I've already said I'd budge my weapon in future work hall. And that was not anything selling, and I don't care about it. It's not that good anyway. Alright, so... Now... Let's go get the next one. Guardians nearby. Local energy fields are spiking like mad. Taken! Filthy creatures. Push them back.
that that light is coming through. to where do take and go far away from here i hope well done indeed that's something new oh there it is it's just a blue weapon and it's a blue weapon it's a blue hand cannon <laughs> Get another cage stash, guys. So let's find another cage stash. And I got a legendary brought in by Ingram for most. I've got three more cage treasure maps to open up. So that is what we are gonna do, guys. Alrighty, guys, so I got the stash that we couldn't find. I'll show you where it is now. So, if you look where I am here, so I'm on this railway and the chest was right here. So the chest is right here. You just come to this area right here where there are a few stairs on the Around there, there's a barrier which was why you keep going on. There's a scannable item here, and uh, actually, there's two scannable items here. And you just grab onto here, and then you can jump onto the um, uh, top line. So, yeah, let's grab the final one. There goes Emperor, there goes Boomy. Uh, let's grab the. Alright, can you guys hear me? Hello? Can you guys hear me? Hello? Hello? Well, I'll be right
All right, can you hear me? Hello? Yeah. Can uh, can you guys hear me? Hello, can you guys hear me? Fixed it. So yeah, guys, now we are gonna um, grab an area over so over here. So over here is our final cage chest, and then we're gonna keep this left. So, Boomy, what do you think of Destiny Weekly? Have you seen it? Have you watched it? Boomy. I can't hear him. Like, oh, can you? So sorry if you guys can hear my puppy up here. Uh, hopefully you will have seen that video tomorrow. Hopefully you'll see that video posted on Wednesday. Uh, about my new puppy. You guys will see that on Wednesday. So, yeah. We got... We got actually only one legendary Ingram from Kid Stashes. This is 75. 75. Okay, okay. so nothing is actually better. This is naturally better, okay. So that's it for arcade stashes today. Now, all we have to do is get some public events going. So let's travel over to the Glutch, where I hope Boomy Emperor and Lego Loto will come. Should be. I'm gonna buy some mods up from down this. All right, so guys. Like the fallen are bringing Ooh, in a yeah, I love these. I love these. Keep a sharp lookout. Um, the EDZ hasn't been on. I haven't been able to do this. So let's. Oh, we still have one more cage treasure chest. I didn't know that. Let's pop a. Shut them down.
Smile, glimmer. Hold them off Basically, while I transfer. Basically, this now is some for yourself, you know. And guys, that is the boot for today, meaning now we have... My course challenge is complete five challenges, I haven't been doing that. But now I have 60% of the EDZ, meaning now I can probably just do one more heroic public event. But Leo wants me to join him, so I'll pop into him here real quickly. I'll launch us to a mission. Guys, uh, I think I'll launch us to probably the Winding Cove. We'll launch down here to the Winding Cove to this public event. Cabal are bringing in a fortified mining lander. I believe this means a resource grab. This antenna was used on the Fallen Network less than a year ago. It relayed a signal out past Saturn. I wonder if they knew about Nessus before we did. Hey, you! Clear out! I'd expect a Cabal mining expedition to be heavily armed. Be careful.
black eye for them. I will. What was that? Oh, just us taking out a mining lander, a ship, and a commander. As you do, I stand in awe. All right, guys. So now let's continue doing some flashpoint. So this will complete flashpoint for the week. This one over here. So let's just go launch to it. So guys, we're going to infuse Mito with this because Mito is a submachine gun and this is also a submachine gun and it's always risk runner, but Mito, I use a lot more in Crucible, so let's just infuse Mito with that gun. Let's pop this gun back into my slot. We got a rocket launcher at 275. Yeah, yeah, and that's why I'm playing uh, Death Games on my Switch. And guys, it is Wednesday, and I just had my surgery this morning, so, uh, yeah, I just had my surgery this morning, and I feel great. I feel great. And I am downloading the Star Wars Battlefront 2 beta, so I can post that up today for Wednesday video, along with my Star Wars The Complete Saga. Talk that goes up to the two. So, yeah, guys, I've got a lot to do. So, of course, as always, I run the sweet business because I'm still trying to figure out how it works and everything. And then, guys, we'll start up with. Forces in the field. We have sightings of Red Legion infiltrators on their way. Let's chase them out. They think they'll spy on my territory. We also, yeah, we get also your rig out of here. Point. Do I see the cabal fleeing with tails tucked? Well done. And now, alrighty, guys, and now for the crucible point of destiny weekly. Guys, now for the crucible point of destiny weekly. Let's do it. Let's complete some Call to Arms in Destiny Weekly. We also have to do Crucible Challenges. 
for my core this week, so that's what we will do. So let's run some crucible challenges, guys. Here we go. And once I get Lego on, we're gonna run some Nightfall, we're gonna run some different stuff, so I'm trying to see... Right, should I run Sweet Business, guys, or should I run the Sturm? Because I was pretty good with the Sturm in the last episode. I think I'm gonna run Sweet Business once, and then if I'm not good, I switch to the Sturm, or switch to the Cold Heart. And the Sunshot is actually better, but it's not as good as the Sweet Business. Um, I've got a fusion rifle here, but I'd rather have these. I don't have any exotic engrams yet this week, guys, meaning we need some exotic engrams if we're going to have a good loot haul this week. So, yeah, I hope we can get some exotic engram engrams. And by the way, I uh, did do what I promised last week, and I did equip a future... No, wait, that's the wrong movie shader. It's the wrong, it's the wrong ship. I did uh, equip a future war card trader onto one of my sparrows right here. So, yeah. By the way, I never showed you guys the uh, lure tab for loop for sweet business. So this is the lure tab for sweet business. Hope you're happy. It's all remembered. Remembered of war. She ran out. She ran out in front. She ran out in front of us. It was like it was like something out of out of pre golden age war. Flack, flick, flick, flick. You know where the hero, hero's bud goes. Out in a blaze of the glory, so the death can be ready. Only to die. Supremacy. Alright, guys, let's play some supremacy. I'll read you that later, but I'll show you it. You can pause it there, but. The rule is simple. Defeat your enemy. Claim their crest. Yes. Now show them the true meaning of war. Once I get my Titan ready to go, I have not completed my Warlock up to there. Yeah, I want to get it to yet. So, once I get my Warlock ready, I will be playing through Destiny Story for you guys on a daily basis. Don't spend all that ammo in one place. You get I have. Oh, there is a lot of I can't wait stuff to see what that you was do released that. in this and which Good. is amazing. Show your enemy what a real fight looks like. Heat comes for us all. Glory comes I've always had never used my super there, but I if you didn't want it, have a chance to. Can be yours again. All right, guys, let's go into the game of Crucible. After that game, we are now. We are now completing 30, 13, 30, 13% of Call to Arms and 45% Clan XP. We are going to Nightfall Guide Games, and once Legolor gets in here, we will... Uh, we are gonna, uh, do some, once Legolo gets in here, we'll do some Nightfall, got a game, and I'm gonna run some Leviathan, which requires 280 power. What game I have? 280, oh, I have to switch guns. <laughs> I have to switch guns to this to get 280 power, and then I should be able to say Nightfall. Yep, now I can access the, the um, got a game version of uh, Leviathan. They want you to be 280 power to do it. Anyway, guys, uh, hopefully we can get some trials in here for you guys. I'm hoping I can get some trials in here for you guys today. Stompies, never use in Crucible. Uh, these increase the damage of trip mine grenades. You can use them. Um, increase sidearm reloading speed. Don't even use these in Crucible. If you want, you can use it in PvE if it's an exotic you have, but I, don't, I wouldn't recommend stuff I have. Um, I've got the Sturm, of course, Graviton, I've got, yeah, I've got Risk Runner, Cold Heart, uh, Sunshot, and I'm currently working on getting a, the Graviton Lance, which is the final piece of the puzzle. Control. Bravo, team. Alright, sorry, I'm just used to saying that stuff from the old game. 
The zones are yours if you fight for them, Guardian. You gained the lead. Don't spend all that ammo in one place. Zone A captured. Zone advantage is yours. Double down. Nips remaining. Double down. Good. Show your enemy what a real fight looks like. Show your enemy what a real fight looks like. Okay, stupid. You should have backed off. If you see a guy holding a sword and it's close quarters, you're not gonna win. Zone A lost. Double down. A well fought victory. Oh, there we go. That's a lot of good stuff there. Because. I really did well that round, guys. You, you saw I was crouching and I was doing well that round. I had my my ratio, my power play kills. So that adds up to 13 kills this round, I think. Which is a really good. I think it's a really good round. Um, for me. Uh, so we got another battle devil's hand cannon. This one is better. We got a blue chest armor. We got an exotic Ingram, first one of the week. So we're playing on Midtown, meaning Supremacy. No Clash, Clash. sorry, Clash. He's Midtown through the Supremacy of Clash, it almost has never no control, but you can play control Just on this map. This map is actually where a really good gun probably would use to the business on, because you have a lot of course quarter fighting. Which sweet business really comes in handy with it. So, this map's probably a good idea to use sweet business on. I can't wait to see what trials is for this week, because I'm going to be running trials this week, so that'll be, that'll be fun. Me and my clan are running trials this week, and we're going to. God! I think I'm the only one with a kill this time. For now, I'm the only one with a kill. You've gotten a kill. I'm the only one in this that I'm just gonna... And, okay, they, they got another kill, okay. So I was like, I'm the only one right now. Oh, you've gotta be kidding. Dude, get the power ammo, you idiot. You're such an idiot. You should go for the power ammo. I just take a sword out. Okay, they got a... Another one. I'm gonna rush in there with sweet business. But yeah, I'm gonna rush in there with sweet business, guys. Here we go. Okay, well, that's not Doobie's volume. And then Doobie's volume, by the way, is really good exotic to play on this map. Yup. Doobie's volume, by the way, guys, is a really good exotic to play on this map. Uh, it's a really good exotic to play on this map, guys, because I recommend it because you can jump out this window and just shoot previous volleys, tracking guards, and it literally just homes it on anything that you get it, it can see. Heat seeking rockets, so it's a really good since Mad Scientist is the perk, it's a really good it's a really good uh gun. Yeah. minutes could go your way could go theirs oh i can't wait to see what you do with that oh i tied it with that kill 
Don't spend all that ammo in one place. Oh, did you guys see that? I, def I blocked it. I literally blocked every shot he fired. You gained the lead. It's time, Guardian. Right, here we go. Crush them. It's all or nothing. Oh, that was a nice golden gunshot. Your enemy has defeated. The best thing about being a guardian is you're never truly beaten. There we go. So I came... I came third. Not bad. Uh, what do we get for calling with call to arms now? So now we are at 52% call to arms. Um, and we are at 65% call to XP pet. And this is actually going towards my new clan, which is the Cobblestone, guys, and Laylord's online. What, when did that happen? There we go, guys. We got Laylord joining us now. So guys, we were almost done with coin XP, and we, yeah, I'm the only one in our coin that's online, but our, but we can get our coin together for a raid, so that'll be fun. I'm playing beta. It's dead. What do you think I'm playing? So yeah, sweet business is great in um, PvP. The next one I want. The next um, exotic I want is is a tractor cannon. That is the next exotic I uh, want. It's tractor cannon. So Lego is logging on now, so I'm gonna cut to when Lego is actually in the game. Or to when he leaves the party, Lego. Okay, guys, so we're gonna run another round then. Crucible. We're gonna click play. I'll play inside. I pause. Let's run another round. Alrighty, guys, let's do this thing. Let's do this guys, here we go. Supremacy. Let's do this. Some supremacy. Play your opponent. Take their crest. Double down. This is how you grow stronger. Your enemy has defeated you. Like I looked up and like I coined him, but he didn't. Didn't die no true defeat except shot. surrender. So now we have 75% in coin XP and 40 and 64% call the arms. Boomy Emperor is still not joining the party. Once I'm done with all this, I'm gonna do the unlimited time glitch for the nightfall this week because there's an unlimited time glitch that I'm gonna pull off with Laylord and Boomy. Control. If uh, Lego load you up for that, if you're up for an unlimited time glitch. Well, it's not a glitch, it's just how to get unlimited time. They are your life. Zone, zone B lost. It's time, Guardian. Crush them. 
Zone B captured. You have zone advantage. You took them. Now hold them. Any work, so I'm getting a UE boom. So they're actually pretty interesting. But that's the thing, an instant kill for every shot isn't too fair. It's like, swords are kind of a shock too, as much. But the thing is, is like, with Eternity's Edge, it's like, they, they can't be nerfed too much, but yet again, you know. Don't spend all that ammo in one place. It's not like I have anything against swords, like, oh. Alright, I'm gonna change the name. Good. To the Z-Man fan club. Zones control. Targets eliminated. Nice work. Alright guys, so now we have... Alright guys, now we have uh, 87% in the Kaba Arms and 85% in Clan XP. And I'm close to getting my clan to level 2. Um, edit your banner. Alright guys, so it looks like it's either control or right, guys, supremacy. It like it's supremacy. supremacy. Let's run some supremacy, guys. Careful, guys. Uh, you must protect your crest. And as Jack says, you must protect our crest. So let's do this. It's time, Guardian. Crush them. Dead, dead, dead. Look at them. Dead, dead. And if you're on Xbox and you play this, uh, just hit me up on my messages and saying, hey, I wanted to invite you guys, you like, can, I, you I would certainly play enjoy to have you. some fans in here. You can possibly play with me and call up in That's my weekly, yeah. games, you can possibly play with me. If you guys want to play with me, I will be doing a, a um, Gotta Game series if we get enough people in our clan uh, for the raid. Okay, uh, yeah, I'm dead. Hey, uh, Z-Man, when you're done, let me know. I will, I will, I will. Alright, I'm gonna go down, together, as one. I love it. Guys, to cure my Oh, sorry. Um, I was. I think I was. Now I have completed call the arm. Yeah, I think I was. Just turned on my Xbox. Now. It's probably my mic because I don't know. Mics like I go through a lot. I think this is like 
think the longest I've had with a mic was probably around. I want to say. Glory is yours. Yeah, I'll switch headsets. If it makes like a buzzing noise, just let me know if I can find it. It's. Let me know, guys. We have completed Clan XP and Call of Arms and Crucible Challenges for the week. Oh, yeah. Look at that, guys. Wait, I didn't complete Clan XP. Well, what? Those crests mean uh, Clan XP is at 95%. We've done Crucible Challenges and Call of Arms. Nice job, guys. Now, we are going to run some Nightfall, guys. You ready? Let's go run some Nightfall. Alright. Does it make like a buzzing noise? Mobility because I'm wearing this sleeves. There we go. Mobility should go up now to 10. Because we probably want a lot of mobility so we can run fast. Now, Zer looks like he's up there, so let's go grab him. I had to work my way properly up there so that I can switch my way up it, but no, I don't, I can't. No, so I'm gonna stay there, so I'm gonna switch the way up it. How do they do that? How do they switch their way up this thing? They have to walk up this cave though. Alright, let's go up the cave. Use our mobility 10 just to speed up here. Welcome, so guys, back to the European Dead Zone. So, let's check out what he has for this week. So for this week, for Zero, we have... This is why the nine sent me looks here. like Vigilant's Wing. Wow. That is a very good exotic of I've heard for PvE. I, I, I obviously don't have it. So we have Vigilant's Wing, Foe Tracer. I already got, I already got Foe Tracer. I'll show you here for you guys now. I've already got Foe Tracer. Is it 270 though? Yeah, it's better than 270. Okay. So Foe Tracer. We have Arc Abilities. Trigger faster regeneration and void damage kills recharge. It's faster. The only thing good this week is Vigilance Wing from Zer. The that's the only thing I'd say that's trial. good. There are rules that even hunters must follow. Did someone just hit me? <laughs> okay, so let's uh, let's equip Vigilance Wing here because it is now my like it is now filled out my primary slot. So it is a five shot. Exotic, and this means pretty much everyone is gonna have this. So I recommend watching out for this gun now because everyone's probably gonna have this now because everyone's been grinding to get Zero's to get a lot of their selling and stuff. And this week it was Foe Tracer, so I recommend watching out for Foe Tracer in PvP. Uh, PvE Foe Tracer is not that week. good. I'll show you now why it's not good PvP. PvE this. Just clip it. So Foe Tracer, as you guys can see, it makes you see them through walls. If you've already seen them. But in PvE, it's not that it's not that like it's not that much of a, like a, a weapon to use. Because you can just like I get that everyone said it to use a sword, it kinda works because you can like look at someone and get a relentless tracker on them and you can zoom in on them. Like you should be able to get a relentless tracker on that guy. And then I can crush behind here sneak up on them. It should be really good for the raid for the dogs part. Because you can know where the dogs are without having to really like see the dogs. So, like, I thought it was, which is a kind of just feeling use for this for this helmet. Um I just keep it because first of all it's um, something that I need to be up me now and then. So yeah, that's why I have Poe Tracer on me, but Vigilance Wing, this is a gun that I've been wanting to get. 
Is just died. The video is playing. It's a guy I really wanted. It's a guy that has the hell meaning. I'm not running. It's impossible. I'm going to trials of nine later. Um, my friends, I mean, my clan are going to run some trials of nine later. So hopefully we'll run that. And show you guys all what trials of nine can do. I'm sorry. Did you want some? I didn't think so. Five burst pulse rifle, guys. Get it. Now, let's check. So, do I have, so I have a hand cannon, hand, hand cannon, what the, dude, um, excuse me, but I'm sorry, creature work all hand cannon, I, I can't, I don't need you any, anymore, we're done with creature work all stuff, okay, there we go, so now I can keep vigilance wing on me, and sweet business, and the sturm, I've got so many exotics now, that, yeah, so yeah guys, I've got so many exotics on me now, and I don't think any of the exotic weapons, the weapons this week's actually good. You can choose depending on your play style. If you want to play Strike Robot, I do recommend the Titan Helmet that they're selling. I do recommend the Titan Piece that they're selling. Um, the Void? The Void, you could try. Warlock, but if you want to, you have to use Void Walker. The void Walker is not good for Crook. Well, it is good for Crook. It is good for Crook. Well, I can use it with this one. But Void Walker, I try to be honest, I don't have it. I have Void Walker yet on my cut on my uh, character. So, to be honest, I never even tried out Void Walker in this game. So in the in the actual game, the beta I tried it. It was fun. But anyway, uh, actually, guys, let me tell you a little story about that. The Void Walker was actually the only thing, the only super I could use in Crucible in the beta because I couldn't get any other supers to generate. So the beta is the only super I could use in Crucible. So yeah, guys. Vigilance Wing is the Vigilance Wing is the exotic pulse I think it's a pulse rifle. And that means now that I can actually start doing this exotic quest from Mida. Because I want a Vigilance Wing so I can do this exotic quest from Mida. I just get precision kills with it, so watch this guys. Watch this. Where where is someone? Where is something that I can shoot? Like where is something that I can shoot? Because that'd be that'd be nice. Um, over in this area, Wizard Catch glitched in with us into the uh, lost sector somehow. That should now be a new. That should now should be upgraded to 50. No, still 14. The Cabal are bringing in a fortified mining lander. I believe this means oh, a resource grab. Oh, land here we the miner. Do scout rifles. Oh, I'm using a pulse rifle. Sorry, I'm running the wrong gun, guys. Pulse rifle. Which is what I'm supposed to get kills with this gun. I I, I keep think I keep thinking that it's a scout rifle. So let's actually do this. We can do one public event run here. Let's do one of one public event. Hey, you! Clear out! I'd expect a cabal mining expedition to be heavily armed. Be careful. would be a better gun to use for this. You know the hand cannon I would want to do. The star would be the best way to use it. But they don't want me to use it. They want me to use it. Fourth rifle, and I'm guessing I'm shooting the ship. Guys. Right off camera. Yeah, 
from here. What was that? Oh, just us taking out a mining lander, a ship, and a Now I've done 14% of that. As you do. I stand And multi-kills, I have to do that later because I have to focus on the health. So yeah, guys. I will come back when I'm playing some Trials. Can't wait. That yeah, you changed Why it to stone cold. Hey guys, how we doing? Oh, we are better. back for some trials of nine. We've got our trial. Well. Hey, what up? What up? We've got the clan all. The clan, yeah. We've got the clan all ready to go. Wizard cat, say hi. <laughs> what up, bro? All right, so um, we. Uh, he's not here. Yeah, okay. So we've got Booby Emperor running Stormcaller. He is also running Scatlock. With Scatlock, Scatlock. Risk Runner. And uh, Eternity's Edge. Wait, what? He's running Skate Lock with Skate I'm, run I'm running Skate Edge. Lock. We have Roman Reigns here running Mida, Mida Mini, <laughs> uh, and Widow's Bite. He is also running the Dragon Shadow. And his character looks all the like Zabala. Lego Lord. He's running Mida, Mida Mini, and Radiant Flux. And I am running this. I'm running Vigilance Wing, I am with my sword, and I am running. Ooh, I kinda like that. And I'm running Lucky Raspberry. We're fangirling, man. I think I might use, um, mini tool for this. Alright, everyone get your perks ready to go, cause we're gonna do this. Yeah, this I know. Is fine. So everyone get ready to go. Wait. Are we yeah. going? Everyone get ready to go. I'm ready. Blue geometry. We're gonna use Vanguard Magnus Loss, cause that one looks cool. Okay, I, I gotta go. My ship shader. You do for what? I don't know. I gotta go to someone's house. But we have a soccer game soon. No, we don't. In it's like canceled. canceled. It did. I think. My mom hasn't texted me saying it. Alright, everyone ready? Mom, is the soccer game cancelled? No. Then I think we might have it. <laughs> I mean, if I were you, I wouldn't go because it's wet. Alright, everyone ready for the I'm week? So I'm it's playing. at CDH. Everyone ready turf. for the week? Everyone ready what? to lock our equipment? Oh, yeah, that's Everyone just... ready to lock the loadout? Yeah, that's fine. I still want to go. Are you, kidding me? Are you kidding me? What time is it? It's 5 It is 21. What time is the All game? Right, is everyone ready to lock our loadout? 7. But we have to be by at CDH by 6 4. Right, is everyone ready to lock our loadout? I still, I still want to play. Turf doesn't really matter. 
And besides, uh, you can get yeah, one. Yeah, I know. Does everyone have, does everyone have the loadouts where he's going to be locked up? Oh, then I can't go to his house. But they're on their house. Where are you gonna Guys, go to? Guys, does everyone have a little outro ready? Just tell me. I swear. Call Taylor. No, nope, I'm ready. Back. Yeah. So, guys, I'm running Rigid with Swing for this round. I want to see how it runs in Crucible since I've never ran it in Crucible. And then, if it doesn't work well, I might. It's I'm really run good. Sweet business. Yeah. Uh, Vigilant Swing is a five round. I know what it is. First, I've, I've, I've uh, ran it before. I know what Vigilant Swing is. Yeah, I know. It's really oh, good. Okay. Well, the dead cliff. That's, um. No, that's I personally don't like survival. No, I know. It's either the smaller one or the smaller one. This one is the smaller one. But as always, I've already announced this, but us, me, I'm using Vigilant Swing. Hey. Not using an exotic for some reason. Boomy Emperor, Vigilance oh Wing, Lylord, Mida, and Radiant Flux, huh. Roman, Mida, and Dragon Shadow. I'm back. Our oh, other team, oh, the opponents are running. Yeah, We've right. got Vigilance <laughs> Wing, Mida. Yeah. One, three Vigilance, We've got and Mida. one Mida. And Young's on Expire. Vigilance Wing, and Sun Spicer. Vigilance Wing, and Foe Tracer. So everyone's running Vigilant Wing, so this is gonna be a fun game. Apparently. Wait, uh, are all of you using Vigilant Wing? I'm running Vigilant Wing. Yeah. Guy, guy. I, I did. Oh no, they're right behind Ooh. me. Die. Okay, okay I, we time. might have to go, go to the tower after this camping. match, can we go so I can get sweet business. Please. Cause this map is really fun. Cause I might. Oh, I'll just it. stick together. We'll all stick together. How about that? Yes. Then I, I would have yeah, killed him. I would actually try to win a round. Come on, guys. Let's try to win a round. Yeah, let's do that. I want to. Yeah. Legendary. <laughs> I got a fire-minded complex. <laughs> and so. But it's. Crap. All right, guys. Welcome back to the final part of Destiny Weekly. Um. So I tried to do the raid and I got a few engrams, but I didn't record it because I didn't really do well. So yeah, we're gonna go to the final part of Destiny Wiki. By the way, uh, yeah, let's do this. By the way, let's do this. Here we go, guys. Let's do the final part of Destiny Weekly. Let's first of all, as always, we check the postmaster just to see if I've got any lost items that aren't engrams. Underway. And they're engrams. All right. Well. So, as always, the first person we have to go talk to is Mr. Cage 6. So let's go talk to him. So we're at Cage 6 now. What's the story? We have got our last flag. Work out there in the wilds. And our luminous ingram. So he gives us okay, that. And then we give Cage these. This is glimmer. And we are good to go. So stay safe out there. You got that. Uh, so, so uh, now we're gonna run. Sorry. So now we're gonna run to um, Shacks here. Shacks. You never know what one Alrighty, guys. So now we are at Shacks. You're always pleasantly vicious, Guardian. It's a delight. I'm gonna get that and for my crystal tokens. Crystal Ingram, which gives us the crystal emblem. And there we go. Come back safe, Hunter. The ball that You're I one of the good ones. Let me check what tokens I actually have. I haven't seen in a while. Just easy to see. Okay. So it's a quick. It's gonna be a quick unbox loot on the opening today, guys. But I only have easy tokens this week. Alright, because I've only been playing on the easy. I haven't played on any other map this week. So, let's head over to Horthon and get our final luminous ingram. By the way, look at my sword. It's so amazing, guys. I am so good with the sword, as you guys know from the Crucible Montage. Oh, yeah, I'm talking so fast. Here we go. Talk fast, talk fast, talk fast. Okay, stop. Alright, guys. Up here in Hawthorne. Yeah. I need a minute. I'm you in the middle of this. You just never quit, do you? Took out golf, woke up the traveler, 
And now half of what I hear on the streets is how much you and your clan are making it difference. Walk this way, guys. We That's why I started this whole clan thing in the first place. People. Take care of yourself, okay? I wanted off this ring this whole time, because apparently it can give you an infinite uh, um, super for, um, for your net stalker, so. No, I'm good. Sorry, guys. My family is trying to get me to do stuff. All right. So, guys, let's go to the next part here, which is, I believe, the Crypt Arc. So here is the quick talk. Let's see what we've so got. So with the quick right talk now. here, we have our legendary Ingrams. I've got every. I've probably gotten every legendary up. I have this game, so I'm probably not gonna get anything new. Anything that. And here we go, and we slide in, and we grab this guy. We Underway. grab the rest of these Ingrams. Done. A energy weapon. It's an auto rifle. Meaning I can get rid of whatever that auto rifle is. So I have equipped. Of course I have equipped. Uh, wait, do I have, well, I have equipped auto rifle. Yep. Okay. So we just we just go uh, hover, hover, game, game, hover over it. Here we go. That's my auto rifle. Take that out. Grab this gun. Done, done, done. There you go. Down to the city. All right, and now guys, down and up again. we have our oh, final ingrams to open up. Back from the hunt, I see. And here we go. So our last two legendary ingrams give us those. And our exotic ingram pops us the dragon shadow. That is not. That is not good. I hate the dragon shadow. I've been getting really annoyed with the dragon shadow. And now for our wedding grams. Welcome to Eververse. Alright, so our wedding grams, we got a shell. We got another shell. And we got a shell. Thank you for shopping at Eververse. Alright. Now guys. It's easy math, guys. Oh, we have to get the silver. Eververse has the goods. Come on, come on, come on, game. Alright, so let's go talk to Devin K real quickly. Let's check. He must have the R in the European Desert. Alright, so what you're gonna wanna do is just head to the monastery up top there, so you're gonna walk into the church. Now, something. just hover over the top bit, you can play the 27. Alright guys, so for our first Ingram, we have got... Um, the Hearthon Scored Shotgun, grab the next one. If we have a next one. And I don't think we have a next one, guys. I'm so sorry, but just press it. Yeah guys, we don't have a next one, so just be. And then press start. Hold down start. And now, move. Cursor to oh RB. Then you move the cursor to the traveler, and then press A, and then My land Mark, in the I am white toasty circle. Wall, press A on the white circle, you. and so, uh, you can I send you more tea. <laughs> go to launch and press A. All right, guys. So go to go to the left there. That guy right there. Let's see what he's got. Hold that. What Checking right now. Does he have? He has a shotgun. And it is a energy, or is it a, it is a power? So here, maybe this. For a second. So what you do if you don't have anything is you press pause, and then you just go into your power weapons and you check. This is a sword. It's better than my sword. So we, we're going to infuse it. This sword's got a lot better perks. Uh, so let's do that. And then we can press B and grab that power up. Check. Alright. 
Now you put your back. All oh, done. Right. I'm trying to get dark. I'm like brown. I'm going to go down. The guy with green on top of them. And then we get to bring in those. Good job. Good job. Uh, How did you die? We're not shooting anything. <laughs> sure. That's actually a physical thing. Yeah. 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 That person gets stuff only through um, items that fall. So that's why that happens. So, it's high. Alright, guys, so let's okay. see. What do we got? Pretty much everything we got just went to the postmaster. So, let's check it out. So, we've got a linear fusion rifle, we've got a sidearm, and then we've got a fusion rifle. So, two power weapons and a sidearm. So, let's go with this. Let's check out the sidearm first. Submachine gun 75. Submachine gun 75. You go. Oh, you are primary. Now we should be able to grab that. Okay, so we should be able to grab that primary, and then we check here. We've got Horthon's Forge shotgun, which this shotgun has 281, and our current shotgun has 31. So this we get rid of, and this is a linear fusion rifle, which check, I check, believe check. is better than my current one. Uh, which is right, right here. Yeah, No Man's War set. Oh yeah, way better. You, No Man's War, you can go. Uh, I mean, grab our final fusion rifle and check, 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 check that check. out with this fusion rifle here, which it's better. So we see that. And then, so that's our gear for there. And then we've got a new sot, and then we got our sidearm here, which I don't like sidearms in primary, so let's get rid of it. Uh, then we've got some boots, so let's check. So we've got, okay, so let's just do this. So we've got 270, we've got 280, we've got 288, and a, okay, we've got 288. Okay, so we're going to infuse the 288 with this bad boy, just to get some more, see, so we infuse to add more power, so watch this. Actually, wait, this one doesn't have shade on it. I'm sorry, but you don't have a shader. You just, you don't have a shader, so... I'm so sorry, but you can get put on, and you can go, and you can go, and so can you, thank you, okay, now we've got some, we've got, okay, 87, 87's the best, so we can infuse 87 into this bad boy, uh, 87, where are you, what, okay, so we've got 87 in there, we check the rest of them, so we've got 80 and 85. Okay, so what we can do is we just de-equip this, which, by the way. Okay, where's you go? Uh, we equip that, and now we just check real quick. Nothing better. Oh, wait, better. better. Wait, what? Uh, okay, so you can go. And then you. And then you. Actually, wait, no, I was gonna. I was gonna infuse that into my exotic one's not. So you can check. So we got okay, so we got eight. So this we grab and we infuse these guys into a it's the best 87. Put those guys on. And now we've got 88 power. Wow, I I just bumped power. And then let's see. Oh god. Okay, so let's check powers. So we've got 93, which is going to this bad boy. So, where the heck's 93? It's by 
probably the last one. Yep. Okay, 93. Infuse into this bad boy that pops it up there. And then we've got 75, which this can't be used, so this just goes. And 88 can go into Celestial. There we go. 88 goes into Celestial. And now Celestial, because it's an exotic, also goes up to 93. Meaning it's the, as good as this guy. God. There's nothing, nothing else new. Oh, wait. The, the, the linear fusion, the fusion rifle. So there we go. That's not it, I don't think. Whenever you need me again, Guardian. Oh, dear. So, yeah, guys. That should be it. Unless I get something else from this guy. But, yeah. That should be it. I hope you guys enjoyed the new loophole for today, and yeah, so, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the new loot haul for today, and, make us proud, and, make, and everyone also make sure to subscribe, like, comment, and just support the channel, because you support everyone else but me for some reason, so, please support the channel, and I will see you guys. This is a rare sniper rifle, by the way. That's why, that's why I'm using it. Let's talk. Uh, and it also does that. So, yeah, guys. I see you all later. Bye, guys.